You wouldn't say no to a lady. I don't know why not. They always say no to me. Something must be done. War would mean a prohibitive uh, increases up in our taxes. Hey, I've got an uncle who lives in Texas. No, I'm talking about taxes. Money. Dollars. Dollars? That's where my uncle lives. Dollars taxes. <laughs> Folks, I want you to meet my pal, my best friend. What's your name again? You know, I'd buy you a parachute if I thought it would open. Hey, I got a parachute right here. One dollar and you'll remember me your whole life. That's the most nause nauseating proposition I've ever had. You love your brother, don't you? Nah, but I'm used to him. Hey, look at me and laugh! I've been doing that for 20 years. I've got a good mind to join the club and beat you over the head with it. That's a coleslaw. You ever seen a coleslaw like that? Don't give me any lip. You're looking for someone? Who? Buffalo Bill? Guy eating a watermelon? Ouch, my corn! Corn blow! You're looking for corn blow! It's an old, old story. Boy meets girl, Romeo and Juliet, Minneapolis and St. Paul. Gentlemen, stand back to back. Take five paces, then turn and defend yourselves. Why don't you just give me the $10,000 and everyone will be happy, including the gorilla. And I do mean you. <gasps> I saw your name in the... We need your permission, that's why I'm here. I'm gonna hold an auction in a little while in Coconut Manor. You know what an auction is? Sure, I come over from Italy on the Atlantic auction. Take her pulse. Take her pulse. Oh no no no, my purse, my purse, he has my purse. You must forgive him, he doesn't spell it very well. Ciccolini, you are charged with treason. If you found guilty, you will be shot. I object. On what grounds? I couldn't think of anything to say. Objection sustained. You sustain the objection? Sure, I couldn't think of anything else to say either. This is the place. How are we gonna catch him? Well, that's for flies. Baseball players catch flies. We're looking for football players. That's a hog! Don't you know the difference between a pig and a hog? See, the stowaways. I could help you, bozos. It's Mr. Bozos to you! Why are you burying the last manager? And don't tell me it's because he he's dead. 
But you were worrying yourself over nothing. Andre Rosales died a natural death. And what happened to the manager that preceded him? We caught him stealing money. We were forced to discharge him. I see. You want a manager that doesn't steal money? Good day, gentlemen. With a show like this, you celebrate before. It's awfully hard to celebrate when you're running from an audience that wants its money back.